What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so... We're gonna be checking to see what is next here, because in the last episode, we finished off the whole Team Rocket uh, debacle. Giovanni came back. He revealed that he was indeed the real father of uh, Michelle, or Slash Silver and all that stuff. And then it turns out that Homeboy here, you know, was making a whole bunch of legendary Pokemon suffer. Cut himself growled on, defeated him, and, you know, uh, what's his face? Zane told us that he has a little something for us, so I don't know what to do. I don't know what's going to happen. But whatever happens from here on, guys, it's, uh, I, I'm assuming it's the final parts of uh, all of uh, this walkthrough right here. So, let's continue right here. We're getting a phone call, and it's an unknown number. Answer it, yes. Unknown number, hello? Is that Draven? It's Professor Oak! I got your number from Professor Elm, I hope you don't mind. Anyway, I need to, some help with some things. Come see me at my lab at Palatown. See you soon. So, I guess, uh, yeah, I guess there's still a little bit more to do. And like I said, guys, we're probably yeah we're probably reaching the final like the tail end of this whole walkthrough right here, which I'm excited about because you know Draven's got to do some more some different stuff right here. And yeah, you guys you guys probably already noticed that yeah I'm actually doing Pokemon Heart Gold, and I'm actually glad that you guys are enjoying the first few parts of uh, Heart Gold. But first, before we go into uh, to Palatine, we're gonna go to Vermilion City because. Uh, you know, there is a little something here that, you know, Homeboy told us to go to his place just to talk to him about something. So let's go right ahead and see if we can actually, you know, get whatever he's offering us. And so, let's see, this might be the last time we go in here. And, well, here we are. Okay, so let's see what Zane has to say for us. Talk to him. There you are, Draven. Thanks for stopping by after all that. You were a true help to the organization. Well, here you go, a token of our gratitude. And we get ourselves the HQ badge. And what does that do? That there is an official special HQ's rank. That's right, Draven. You are officially a member of the special HQ. Using that, you will be able to help us out with a huge task. You see, we run a certain battle facility lo located in the far region. We would like for you to be a part of its creation. As part of the special HQ, we get assigned to bring people into this facility, train them to be the ultimate masters, and then put them up against the other Pokemon trainers and themselves. From now on, I would like for you to recruit these people into the facility for us. If you happen to see anyone you think is worthy, then bring them in. I'll leave the rest up to you. Okay, so I guess we're the recruit. I, yeah, I guess we're a recruit. I don't even know how to do that. Huh. There is quite a few people that I kind of want in this. You know, Red comes to mind because he is a pretty damn good Pokemon trainer. Uh, let's see, rematch. I'd love to have a rematch with you one day. Come back when you're stronger. I am stronger, okay? So that's that. Let's go right ahead and go to Pallet Town because Professor Oak has a little something for us right here. So here we go, Pallet Town. And... Well, we're here at, uh, you know, Red's house, and, well, let's see what this guy's saying. Name Red, he's my friend from Wallabo, trying to find... Okay, so we already beat him. And has Red returned? Let's see. I mean, we beat him a, a while, like, a few episodes ago, we beat him. And nobody is... Yeah, nobody is mentioning anything about Red. So, never mind. Okay, so let's go straight to Professor Oak and see what he has to say. Alright, walking in here, and there's Professor Oak. Ah, there you are, Draven. It's good to see that you can make it. I need you to help me out. I have a friend called Professor Ivy who lives out in the Valencia Island, which is part of the Orange Islands. She recently obtained a mysterious Pokeball and can't make uh, make head or tail of it. I agreed to take a look at the, poke, uh, the ball with my scanner, but it's too available to ship over here, and I can't leave this lab to get it. That's why I need your help. You've traveled far with your Pokemon, Draven. I would like for you, I would like for you to fetch the ball for me. It shouldn't be a problem for you and your Pokemon. You will need to get your SS ticket stamped 
to be able to travel to the Orange Islands, here you go. I've spoken to the SS office in Vermilion City. They will stamp your SS ticket for you to able to be able to go to travel the Orange Islands via the Undersea Express service on Route 100. The trainers over in uh, in the Orange Islands are quite powerful, so you better watch your step. Good luck. Okay, so. Challenge accepted, I guess? I don't know. Shoot! Man, it just, like like I said, guys, it just never ends. And I, I've said it, it quite a few episodes ago, too. We have to actually have a team. Yeah, we actually have to have a team ready because, like, you know, me just training all these Pokemon up is just nothing. Uh, we gotta have a team ready just for every single one of these trainers right here. So let's go right ahead and move out a Pokemon. So. Let's see, at this point, yeah, at this point, I might have to be using some pretty special Pokemon. Let's see, what do we got? Well, we already got a powerful Pokemon right here. And, well, I think we're gonna have to go back to Avalanche for the time being, but eventually I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to have to, like, you know, train up some Pokemon right here. Some legendary Pokemon, because I kind of want to finish this whole thing up right here at the time being, and, uh, well, that is the goal. Sweet Boom, you've done your job. So let's put them back right here and. Well, let's go. Well, actually, you know what? We gotta heal our Pokemon. Wait, hold on. Gotta see our Pokemon. Nope, they're all healed. Okay, so let's go to the SS port right here and see what this is all about. Finally, the uh, Valencia, or finally the Orange Islands, and. Uh, we gotta go to this guy right here. Talk to this guy, I guess. Ah, I see a stamp ticket uh, there. I guess you are looking to travel to Valencia Island. If you speak to the manager in the SS office de uh, department, they will give you the sea pass free of charge. You can use it to ride the Undersea Express. We hope to see you again. Okay, so where is that? You came from Johto. Here, 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 Pokemon. Okay, so where, where in the hell? Okay, so, uh, no. The SS, the fast SS Aqua. Uh, okay, so uh, what the hell am I doing? Okay, so go to Route 100 then. I think that's what the deal is, because I already traveled over there. So let's see, we gotta go to Route 100 right here. And hmm, I think I just missed step right here. Okay, so. Let's see, let's talk to this guy. Hello and welcome to the Undersea Express. Would you like to board the train to Valencia? Can I see your stamps? Sorry, but you can't board without the stamps. Okay, so I think I know where, where it's at. I kind of messed it up right here. Undersea Express, no, 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 I don't want to talk to you. Okay, so I think where, I think I know where I need to be at, okay. God dang, it's always something right here, god dang. Okay, so back to Vermilion. Speed this up right here. And I think, let's see, Kanto office block. This could be it, probably. I don't even know. Let's see. Hello, welcome to office block. Uh, important offices. Oh, okay, so the SS office is right here. You uh, look at Valencia Island. Okay, so there we go. Okay, so we're gonna go up here. And I don't think. Okay, so let's see. Uh, SS ticket, yes. And authentic one, we flashed it, thank you, and we are getting our thing stamped by a Nintendo. And, well, let's see, we just got this thing stamped. And now that you have the stamp on your, on you, you can ride freely to Undersea Express. The Undersea Express can be found just off the coast of Newbark Town in Route 27. Have a nice day, okay, and let's see. At this office, you can find information, okay, and what happens here? Wow, that's pretty much it, and presentations, design, okay, so, done our thing here, so now we gotta just, yeah, we gotta go all the way back. Man, I'm like cluttered right here, so, again, let's go back to Route 100, speed this up again, speed, look at that, okay, so here we are, now we can actually go to Valencia Island, and, yes, and, Flash ticket, go on through the building to the, or the building to go down to the platform area. We hope you enjoy your trip. Okay, so finally we can get to the Orange Islands right here. 
And here we are in Route 100. A new, the newest part right here. And all we gotta do is go here. And... Okay, what the... F okay, let's see. Platform, Valencia Island. Platform 2, closed for maintenance. Okay, so that is that. Come this way to the train, and I'm pretty sure they didn't come up with any kind of, like... Yeah, they didn't come up with any animation. They didn't... They couldn't do that. They, probably they, didn't, they don't know how. What was that? What's going on? What happened? Where are we? Ah, oh, crap. What the hell's going on? I knew I shouldn't have gone this thing. I want to go home. Oh, crud. Okay, so let's see. What's going on? I'm scared. And... Sorry. What the heck? What the hell's going on here? Please remain calm and stay in your seat, kid. What? You want to help? Are you crazy? This situation is too dangerous. We have no idea what could be out there. And either way, I can't let a single person out there, especially when they were all alone. Okay, so this guy pushes. He's like, then I'll go with him. And you are... The name is Jin. I'm an ex-gym leader. There's nothing me uh, There's nothing me and my Pokemon can't handle together. Hmm. And why can't... Uh, why do you want to help this kid? Do you know him? He just looks at me and he's like, I admire his spirit for wanting to help these poor people all alone. Sorry. And I'm also interested to know what's going on out there. Well, hmm. Um, uh... Okay, if you promise to look after the kid. Yeah, whatever. Ju just let us go. Let us go. Thank you for volunteering to help. I'll open the door. Good luck. Long time. Come on, kid. Let's get moving. I don't know what I've got myself into. Sigh. Lots of sighs, man. This guy likes to sigh a lot. And the hell? Okay, so where? And we're getting attacked by a Pokemon. And... Well, level 47, okay, so... Put him on some repel, because there are some Pokemon right here, and... Oh, Ball Sack! <laughs> it's Kyogre! <laughs> oh my god. Draven, that Pokemon, it's the legendary Kyogre! It's very powerful, but what the heck is it doing here? We must, we must have hit it! That's the sound, of, that's the sound we heard. Draven, I'm gonna regret saying this. Show me what you got. Aw, oh, crud, so... Okay. Oh, damn. So, we're gonna have to capture this Pokemon right here. And it's at level 70! God dang it! Okay. Okay, maximum effort. I am going to regret this. Okay, so let's flash it. Hydro Pump, Crap Baskets. Um, ah, here we go, Shroomly. I'm trying not to use that extra Master Ball that we have. And, yeah, this Pokemon is going to be a little tough. And, again, and, uh, let's see. Ah, shit. We might have to use the Master Ball on this guy, because it's going to be using Double Edge. And, let's see. Yeah, we, we might have to use uh, the Master Ball on this guy. And look at that. Okay, so it's gonna keep on using double edge, making itself susceptible to to, to to faint. So screw it, Master Ball. I don't care. I really don't care. So here we go, Master Ball. And there we go. Look at that. We caught Kyogre, and let's see. The data has gone in there. This Pokemon is said to have expanded the sea by bringing heavy rains. It has the power to control water. Okay. No, we are not renaming this Pokemon. And, well, it's now at box 14. And this guy's going to be looking at us like, Wow, Draven, that was quite a showdown. <sighs> should have battled it, though. When, uh, should have battled it, though. Then you could have seen my Magnetric in action. Okay. Did someone say Magnetric? That's an electric Pokemon, right? You see, the power in the train has gone out, and we need to give uh, both engines a jump start. Two electric uh, electric Pokemon will do the trick. We just defeated the legendary Pokemon, and you want more? Huh. Fine. Come on, Magnetic. Let's do this. Wow. This guy is uh, something. 
Thank you for saving us uh, for, uh, from that Pokemon. So it was a very big, or it was a big and powerful Pokemon Legendary one. I wonder how it got here in the first place. Oh well. I hope you have an electric Pokemon to help us start the train again. This tunnel is filled with high amounts of electricity. The power cables for the train run down below the ledge there. It attracts a lot of wild electric Pokemon because of its high voltage. Okay, so I do have Raichu. And that is pretty much it right there, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and use a Raichu. Let's see, where... where okay, so where do... Okay, so where the hell do we go? Let's see, right here. Oh, right here. Okay, so talk to this guy. Me and Main Electric have this side covered. Uh, you take the other side, Draven. Okay, so... Here? Right here? Okay, stop. Do you want to use it? Yes. Choose a Pokemon. And right here we have Sparky. And... Okay. Oh, wow! You did it! The engine has started again. You and Jin are very well today. Did very well today. Thanks to you both... Or thanks to you both, the train can now make it to make its way to Valencia to Island. You better board uh, the train quickly. Thanks again for your help today. Okay, alrighty, right on. You did good today, Draven. Maybe I'll see you around Valencia Island at some point. Catch you later. Okay, so that is that, and well. Okay, so we just made it to Valencia Island here, and, well, let's see, what is Special HQ? Oh, wow. So this is the Special HQ that we could have gone to, so let's go straight up. And here we are in the Valencia port, and I'm assuming this is a, let's see, I hope you had a nice ride, see you soon. And trains going right here. Okay, so I'm assuming this is kind of like the Sevi Islands and all that stuff. I'm waiting to train in Johto. Uh, let's book one here. Just uh, Johto's in. Okay. And what do you have to say? It's a nice, peaceful place. It's laid out the beach there. Okay, so that is that. And just express information. Do not want to talk to you. And there's a lot of quite a bit of Watch out. Okay. See, so they, they are warning me that there's trainers, and, well, here we are in Valencia Island, and there is a trainer there, and I just saw you arrive earlier. How new are you here? Okay, so, here we go! Let's see how tough these trainers are. And the song is not that great. I don't even know, and uh, this Pokemon trainer has a level 63 Pidgeotto. Okay, so... Of course, he's going to take advantage of my Pokemon right now, just being weak and everything. So, coming out with another Pidgeot, Crud Baskets, I don't have that, but I do have an Avalanche right here. And let's go with a Blizzard. And, god damn it, why do I keep on missing? Ah, oh, jeez, okay, so here we go. Blizzard attack for the win. And, you know what, let's go with oh, Crud, I don't even... Ice Beam. There we go. Lots of skilled Pokemon, I should say, because they like to use the, the, the boost attacks and all that stuff. Yeah, I'm pretty strong right there, so let's go right ahead and heal my Pokemon that I need, because, yeah, that is going to help. Now, if you guys think that I did wrong by using the Master Ball, or if you guys know something, let me know, because I kind of have a feeling that I probably did something wrong. I don't even know. So, let's see. Master Balls. Don't really care, so. Let's see. Valencia Island. Actually, let's go ahead and check the map right here. Actually, that's my trainer card. I wonder if you even win your badges or something like that. I don't even know. Okay, so let's see the Poke Gear. Use. And let's go with the map. And we need an expansion card. And would you look at that? We are in Valencia Port, and this actually gets us to Essence Town. All the way to Meadow Town, all the way to Leaf Bay City, and Safari Town. Well, look at that, Safari Town. So, do you guys remember how I mentioned that, you know, maybe, just maybe, the Safari Zone director has left to the far, far away place, to the, you know, the Safari, or to, a, to the Orange Islands? Well, there you go again. It might be it, and then the Crystal Caves, you might see the Crystal Onyx, uh, the Westvale Port, and then you got Sandway Town, and that is nothing, 
So that, like, I guess those things are incomplete right there. Mandarin City. And... Oh, damn. So I think we're close to the very end right here, guys. So I don't even know. Battle this guy. And he's going to have an Omni right there. So this is uh, actually pretty new right here. Let's go extremely Hydro Pump right there. Giga Drain for the Deluxe. And coming up with a Nido King. So let's go Sky Uppercut. And there's that Double Kick. So I probably should have gone with the Water Type Pokemon right there. So Poison Sting. Let's go Surf Attack. There we go. And coming up with a Nido King. Let's go Surf Attack again. And... Sorry to bother you. Okay. So, I th yeah, these guys are strong, but they're really not impressing me right now. You're not from around these parts, aren't you? If you were, you would not know the interrupted fishermen. Okay, so they kind of have some kind of deal right here. So, here we go. Let's go ahead and beat these guys. Level 63 Pokemon and all that crud. So, we're just going to continue. He does have a lot of Rem Raid. Oh, three Rem Raids. And there we go. Okay, so... Oh, crud. What does this guy have to say? Sorry, but access to Corsola Cave is restricted due to recent gang activity. I'm sorry for any problems. Oh, crud. More gang activity right here. And, let's see. Route 47, Essence Town to Southwest Port. And, let's see. Here we are in Essence Town. And we found a Pokemon Center. And she's like, I love this place so much. It's always been peaceful and happy. And let's see, talk to this one. Who's there? Please. I lost my black glasses somewhere around these, around here. Please help find them. Okay. Do we have an item finder? I, I'm pretty sure I have one. Okay, so there we go. Nope. There's nothing. Or There's a Psyduck just running around, so we're going to have to see what this guy has to say. Is he tired to speak? The hell is going on right here? All right, let's go to the Pokemon Center and see what this is all about. So let's see, heal our Pokemon. Okay, so let's see. The Pokemon Centers in Valencia Island are less equipped than the centers in the main regions. What do you mean less equipped? Uh, butthole, hold on. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, we can still get our Pokemon right here. What do you mean by less equipped? Probably because of this and the movie learner. No. Okay, so. Okay, so let's see. What does this guy have to say? This is one of the Pokemon centers in the Orange Islands. It's nothing compared to the one in Leaf Bay City, though. Okay. So we're gonna pause right here, guys. We're gonna we're gonna take a look at this whole island in the next episode, and uh, we'll see what happens. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>